this together. We will continue to do this together. thing is for me to go to the enchanted forest and find that voice. Hello everyone, this is your pal Nick here, 2001, your home of the first of the content. I'm very apologize about that. I am watching Freeform, just getting ready for my Christmas classic review on Rudolph Away Nose Reindeer, Santa Claus coming to town, and Farsi Snowman. Let's turn down a bit. Anything, guys, and we'll go back to another Christmas review week. Last, last time I talked about Santa Inc., which honestly, that is the stupidest show I ever seen in my life. Anything, guys, so today I'm doing a movie review on Widow Woman, came out of the year of 2019, which is the best year for movie because we have Frozen 2, The Avenger Endgame, Night Fell, and, and Toy Story 4, and Lego Movie 2, and How to Dream Dragon 2. Anything, guys, let's get my thought. ANC guys, I have not seen this movie because this movie came out on Christmas Day, which honestly, I was so busy spending time with the family, and I hope you guys understand that. And so anyway, after I watched this movie on Star this morning, and I gotta say, this movie is such an awesome, brilliant masterpiece. This movie is way better than and Lady Bird, which honestly, my thought on Lady Bird is freaking boring and a waste of my time, and one of the most overrated movie of 2017, and that movie is so freaking boring and make me want to fall asleep, and make me want to fall asleep to death. Yeah, I cannot stand Ready Bird, and I will do a win of it in the future, god damn it. Anything, guys, so yeah, do any negative? No, I, I cannot think any negative at all. So if you like Ready Bird, I can your opinion, but for me, it's a, such a boring movie, just like Scoob all over again. Hey, guys, so yeah, let's get my positive. Let's get the story. The story is really original. And the cinematography and the production and the costume design are really beautiful too. This movie is trying to be like an Oscar movie, but it is. It got nominated for Oscars. So yeah, I'm really hopeful about that. Hey, guys, let's get the character, shall we? Let's get the character of Amy. She's the voice of the same actress. She was in Black Widow at, as Black Widow's sister. Oh my god, I'm so attractive of her. Anyway... And she was she was good in this movie. She was good, not the best, but she good. And Emma Watson character, her as Meg, one of the best performances I ever seen for Emma Watson. She's way better than she was in the Tale of Dispo. I was a princess. Screw that freaking bitch. And so yeah, and my favorite character of this movie has had to be Joe Marsh. Joe Marsh, she's a really a beautiful character, and out and hands down one of the most of one of the most female crush I have ever seen in Christmas 2019. And so, yeah, and the one character, he's from Dune. He's a really great character. Um, I'm really sorry, he's a great character of the movie. And Beth, she's a really beautiful character. But my favorite character of this movie is Joe Marsh. I still have a crush on her until this day. And she's over here. Such a beautiful woman. And the ending of the film, all really great too, anyway. And, and this movie is so great too. And I have nothing to say about the story, uh, about this movie. So, all four guys, Wonder Woman is such a, one of the best Christmas movie of 2019. With a brilliant story, unforgettable character, and the, and the beautiful and an Oscar worthy cinematography and the character design. And so, yeah, I am giving Wonder Woman a 10 out of 10. This is epic, brilliant masterpiece. This movie deserving a few of Nick Hick awesomeness and ho ho ho. And so, yeah, that was my movie review on Wood of Woman. Tell me what's on this movie on the comments section below without a spoiler. And so, yeah, my tomorrow is you for my review on Fred Claus. And I have not seen Full Christmas, but I just heard Mature did not like that movie. And, uh, oh boy, I had to watch so many awful Christmas movies. And so, yeah, and on Monday, I will do a review on the Christmas classic, like Wood of a Red Nose Reindeer, Frosty Snowman, a Charlie Brown Christmas redo review on Santa Claus is Coming to Town. And so, yeah, if you like this Christmas spirit video, you know as well, I'm not going to repeat myself. Alright guys, I'll see you next time. So long. Peace your tooth. Now excuse me, I'm going to watch Arthur Christmas. Nikki 2001 is over now. What would I do without you? You'll always have me.